the world's smallest hearing aid is now available in Australia. The device is about the size of a five cent piece and is virtually invisible when worn. But deafness experts warn smaller doesn't necessarily mean better. Thomas Poulter's hearing has been getting gradually worse for years. He's never worn a hearing aid until today. And what better way to try out the new sound quality than listening to a performance from the Australian String Quartet. Beautiful, probably for the first time in 10 or 15 years that I've actually heard the music in total. One in six Australians suffer hearing loss and it can affect people of all ages. 45-year-old Pierre Kaldawi listens to a lot of loud music and his hearing has lost some of its sharpness. Today he tried the super small hearing aid for the first time. A lot of people say that uh, it doesn't, you know, you can't see it on or, you know, but I, I don't feel it on there myself, so yeah, it's, uh, it's very comfortable. The American-designed touch hearing aid is now being manufactured in Adelaide and sold in Australia. It's about half the size of what was previously the smallest product. It costs between $1,500 and $5,000, depending on the model. Advocacy group The Deafness Forum says younger people may prefer the discreet design of the touch, but warns it's not for everyone. Sometimes it's difficult to put all of the features into a very small hearing aid, but it very much depends on the electronics and the technology that's in that hearing aid. Another thing to consider, though, is for especially older people and people who have dexterity problems, a smaller hearing aid can be harder for them to use. The Deafness Forum advises hearing impaired people to see an audiologist to get advice on the best hearing aid for them. Rachel Baker, World News Australia.